Hello, guys. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, Good teacher. Evening, teacher. Good evening. Can you listen to me? Yes. Yes. Okay. It is a raining. It is raining so hard here where I live, and I don't have a uh, power. The power went off. So I am waiting for right? the power come back. No, I am not electrical on the vivo. I don't know where you in the place you live. It is raining too. Is it raining too? Está lloviendo. Yes, yes. Está lloviendo. Yes, right. Okay, I'm so sorry to delay with you today. How are you today? How are you today? Uh, I thank you, teacher. Okay. Miriam, how are you today? I'm okay. uh, happy. I'm happy. Okay, you are happy. Okay, nice. And let's see, we can see Ronald, Lorena, Michelle, Roxana, Lorena Elizabeth, Kathy, Elizabeth. Welcome to the class. Oscar, Casi uh, okay. no la escuché de teacher, está entrecortado porque ya comenzó a llover aquí con mi casa. Ok, I understand, I understand, no problem, it is raining too. Sí, ya escuché algo cortado, está lloviendo muy fuerte. Sí, that is the reason, it is raining too much. Casi no la escucho porque está lloviendo. Buenas noches, me voy conectando ahorita, vengo entrando a la casa, viene una tormenta fuerte. También me okay. We have internet. the same problem, we have the same problem. Uh, are you happy because you have already finished this course? Who is happy? Today is our last class. Are you happy because uh, you you have finished this English course, so now you are able to print your diploma. Yeah, yeah, that's the diploma. Okay, ¿quién está feliz de haber terminado este curso? Me, teacher. Okay, excellent. I'm happy, I'm happy. Okay, my dear consuelo say, I am happy. Okay, I am right. happy. Oh, Michelle Aguilar is happy too. Michelle say, escucho cortado. Michelle, it is because of the rain. Es debido a la lluvia. It is raining a lot. So yes. let's see. Today we are going to have our final review. This is the final, um, the final course review. So beginner two, you have completed the course, that course. So let me show to you what we're going to to do work today. Okay. Um, let me know, please, if you can see my screen. Yes, teacher. Yes. Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay, beginner two, final review. This is our final review. We are going to have some, some exercise to finish this in this part. So do you have any question? Um, did you finish the platform? Todos los que estamos conectados ya terminamos la plataforma, the final exam. So how do you feel about that? Was it difficult? Was it easy? Este curso estuvo difícil, estuvo fácil. How did you feel this? ¿Cómo sintieron ese curso? Mm -hmm. Who want to share? Who want to share? ¿Quién quiere compartir? I was learn too much, teacher. Ok, you learn too much. Excellent. I'm happy. I'm happy for that situation. 
Eh, Oscar, do you want to say something? Sí, eh, en español le voy a decir. <ríe> Buenas noches. Okay. Sí, este, sí, fue bastante, para mí fue eh, un poco difícil, pero bastante alentador y muy nutritivo. He aprendido mucho con usted, teacher. Ok, thank you, Oscar. Thank you. Eh, Alguien más? Someone more is going to share something. How do you feel about this course? ¿Cómo se sienten acerca del curso de haber terminado? Are you happy? Are you sad? Eh, buenas noches. Este, yo lo sentí eh, un poco difícil, pero me gustó la dinámica y la, la forma como nos enseñó a, a pronunciarlo. Y este, siento de que aprendí mucho, aprendí mucho. Thank you, María Consuelo. Thank you very much. Someone more? I like your class and, and learn too much. Thank you, Lorena Elizabeth. Thank you. Someone more? <clears throat> Who is angry with the teacher? Nobody? Nobody is angry with the teacher. No, buena dinámica, teacher. Nos, nos alentaba que todos participáramos. Eso okay. nos ayuda a aprender más. Ok, thank y you. Y a esforzar, esforzarnos cada día más. Ok, and I'm sure you're going to learn this language, right? English is a beautiful language and it's very useful too. El inglés es un lenguaje muy bonito y también es muy útil, ¿verdad? ¿vale? En muchos campos, right? En muchos campos y estoy seguro que si ustedes continúan aprendiendo, en el futuro les va, va a ser una herramienta que les va a servir mucho. So I'm really happy um, to meet you in this course. Estoy muy feliz de haberlos conocido. Um, I don't know, right? In, in the future, I'm going to be your teacher again. But it has been a really nice experience. Ha sido una... Bonita experiencia haber estado con ustedes. Parece que Luis está a oscuras también, ¿no? Yes, teacher. Good evening. Hello, good evening, Luis. Es que vengo manejando, teacher. Estoy fuera de San Salvador. Ah, ok. Be careful, y Luis. me acabo de conectar. Pues me logré conectar. Pero okay. según he oído a todos los compañeros ahí, yo también agradecerle mucho. El, el curso ha sido súper dinámico. Me ha gustado, he aprendido mucho, realmente agradecido realmente con usted porque ha dedicado su tiempo pues desde, desde que comenzó esto y yo realmente vuelvo y lo repito agradecido porque he aprendido mucho, teacher. Ok, thank you Luis, just be careful. Thank you. you are trying yes. to be careful. Ok. Please, please be careful. Thank you. Okay, so thanks to in support too and also in this corporativo, right? For this program. Uh, um, so let's start with today's class. Beginner final, beginner to final review. So we're going to start with this. You want to know this, making sentences. Um, someone says, teacher, why don't you in the last class uh, explain again how to make sentences in simple present? So I have this, right? This is the structure we are going to use to make sentences in English. Uh, we need a subject, a pronoun. Uh, a subject can be a pronoun, right? I, you, we, they. And we are going to need a verb. First part of the verb. La primera forma del verbo, ¿verdad? Sin conjugarlo con estos pronombres. Y en las terceras personas, que son cuáles? ¿Cuáles son las terceras personas? Which are the third person? Okay. What happened with the verb in the third person in simple present? ¿Qué le sucede a los verbos en tercera persona en el presente simple? Se les agrego una S. S o I S. Okay, excellent. Dependiendo de en qué letra termine el verbo, ¿verdad? vamos a agregar una S, una IS o IES. 
and S. Vamos a agregar la S, ES o IES. So I have some very here. Can you tell me a sentence using this word? Podemos decir oraciones utilizando esos verbos. Can you help me with that, please? Puede I, utilizar los pronombres que están arriba. I live in Soyapan. Ok, excelente. I live in Soyapango. Ok, I live in Soyapango. ¿Está correcta esa oración? Yes, it is right. I live, yes. in, I live in Soyapango. Good word. Tell me a sentence. <laughs> yes, activate I, your microphone I, and tell me the same things. I work. I, I go. I work in a big company. I work. Can you please repeat? I work in a big company. Okay, I work in a big company. Thank you. That is an excellent sentence. Let's go with the next one. Who wants to participate? This is your turn. Today is your turn to make sentences. Es su turno para decir oraciones. Who wants to help me? Help me, please. You can do it. I'm sure. I need. I need. Uh, I need. Uh, I need the vacation. ¿Cómo okay. se puede decir? Necesito una vacación. I need some vacation. Okay. I need vacation. We say I need vacation. I need vacation. So do I, right? So do I. I need some vacation too. I need vacation. I need vacation. Any other sentence? Utilicemos la I go. Yes. Ah, I go. tercera person. I go swimming every weekend. I go swimming every weekend. Yes, that is a nice sentence. Thank you. I go swimming every weekend. Okay, un voluntario para leer los cuatro ejemplos que dictaron sus compañeros. A volunteer, please, to read the sentences. I live in Soyapango. I work in a big company. I need vacation. I go swimming every weekend. Thank you. Roxana Marcela, can you read the sentences, please? I live in Soyapango. I work in a big company. I need vacation. I go swimming every weekend. Okay, thank you. Now, third person. Tercera persona. La tercera persona. He, he, drives, he drives in the car. He drives a car. Thank you. He drives... Okay. Any other example, another person? Twice. Yes. Okay. She lives yeah, in San Salvador. Thank you. She lives in San Any other, any other same thing? He, he works, he works in, at, at hospital. Thank you, he works at the hospital. One more, one sentence is more, please. One sentence more. To ride the bicycle. Thank you. Right advice school. Okay, excellent. I volunteer to read the sentences. One volunteer to read the first sentences, please. He drives a car. She lives in San Salvador. He works. She lives. You ride a bicycle. No recuerdo cómo se dice bicicleta. 
Bicycle. Bicycle. Okay. In the second sentence, is she lives or she lives in San Salvador? Live. Lives. Lives. She lives. She lives in San Salvador. Thank you. Okay. Now, how to make negative sentences? ¿Cómo hacemos las oraciones negativas? Necesitamos la ayuda de dos auxiliares. Don. And. I does. Okay, do and does, but in negativo sería don't and doesn't. Necesitamos doesn't. esos auxiliares para formar las oraciones. Un ejemplo, who wants to tell me an example, please? Tell me an she, example, please. She doesn't live in Salatenango. Okay, she doesn't live in... Chalatenango. Okay. She doesn't live in Chalatenango. Thank you. Any other example? I, I, I don't, don't work. I don't drive a car. In a restaurant. Okay, excellent. You say, I don't work. I don't work. And I don't drive a car. I don't drive a car. I don't drive a car. And uh, who say, I work in a restaurant. I work in a restaurant. Okay. And with third person, any other example using the third person? No, one example. He doesn't need, um, I don't know. Uh, a house. <laughs> you doesn't need a house? <laughs> yes. Okay, he doesn't need a house. Él no necesita una casa. Probablemente ya tiene una, ¿verdad? A big house. Right? In a beautiful house. Right, no. <laughs> okay, he doesn't need a house. Excellent. Who wants to read the sentence? A volunteer or a victim? She doesn't, she doesn't live San Salvador. Thank you. He doesn't live in San Salvador. He doesn't live in San Salvador. Okay. Thank you. Entonces, de esta manera hacemos oraciones afirmativas, poniendo primero el sujeto, después el verbo, the subject, the verb, and a complement. Y un complemento. Y en las terceras personas, never forget to use es es o IES. It is going to depend. A la mayoría de verbos, we're going to add S. A la mayoría. Most of the verbs use S. Ahora, los verbos que terminan en O, X, CH, and SH, we are going to add ES. ES. A los verbos que terminen en una consonante más en esta combinación consonant plus eh, consonant plus white we are going to delete white vamos a borrar la y vamos a agregarle la terminación ies ies en decir right? y en las oraciones negativas dasen en tercera persona y con los con I, you, we, they, we are going to use done. And for the equation, we are going to use this structure. Can you tell me a question? Let me write ground for you. Are you live? Uh, are you live in San Salvador? Oh, in this case, we say, do you, do you live? Do you live in San Salvador? Sorry. Do you live in San Salvador? 
What is your answer? Can you please answer this question? Do you live in San Salvador? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Who say no, I don't. Oh, no, I don't. Okay, no, I don't. Okay, excellent. Do you get angry easily? Do you get angry easily? Yes. Yes, I do. No, I don't. Say no house there. No, I don't. No, I don't. Okay. Okay, let's go. Do you? Do you like? Do you like what? Do you like oranges? Les gustan las naranjas? Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes, yes, I do. And, okay. In caso de las terceras personas, das, right? Das. Das he. And das she. And that's it. She. Does he work at the hospital? Trabaja ahí en el hospital? That is a question. Here is another one. What are the answers for those questions? ¿Cuáles son las respuestas para esas preguntas? Yes, I do or no, I don't. Yes, she does or yes or no, she doesn't. Yes, you're right. En yes. El caso, en el caso de la segunda sería yes, she does, no, she doesn't. Mm. Right, okay, here we go. Does he work at the hospital? Yes, he does. That is one answer. Oh no, he doesn't. Or no, he doesn't. Yes, he um. does. In this one, no, she doesn't. Okay, excellent. Let's go with the next exercise today. I have this exercise for you. Can you answer the following question? And let's go with the first one. What time do you get up? I'm going to ask. Um, let me at, at six o'clock. At six o'clock. Okay. Yeah. Ronald Antonio, what time do you get up? I get up at five o'clock. At five o'clock. Oscar Baltazar, what time do you get up? Okay, let's go with Michelle Hernandez. What time do you get up? Yeah, let's go with someone more then. Katia Elizabeth Hernandez, what time do you get up? Hello, are you there? I get up and nine. A.M. Okay, I get up at 9 a.m. Thank you. Next question, what time do you go to work? Catherine Giselle, what time do you go to work? I go to work by the student um, six o'clock. Okay, I go to study at six o'clock. Thank you. Lucila Patricia, how do you get to work? Turn on your microphone, turn on your microphone. Perdón, eh, ¿es la forma en cómo me voy para el trabajo? Yes, how do you get to work? I, I drive a car. Okay, excellent, I drive a car, very good. Marta Carolina, how do you get to work? I go to work. Okay, I walk to work. I walk to work. Thank you. Do you go to do you go to work by bus, Marie, Miriam Rocio? No, I don't. I drive at work. 
Okay, I drive to work. Excellent. Do you go to work by car, Noel? Sorry. Uh... Do you go to work by car? Yes, teacher. Yes, okay, excellent. Uh, let's go with Lisbeth. Lisbeth, what do you do? Um, I do class the English. <laughs> oh, what what is the meaning of the equation? What do you do? A qué se dedica? ¿Qué hace? Se dedica, ay, perdón, perdón, perdón. Sí, no problem, no, no problem. Ah, okay. Um, no sé cómo. I I lawyer. Oh, okay. I am a lawyer. I am a lawyer. Okay, yes. I am a lawyer. Uh, what do you do, Michelle Aguilar? I I only am a student. Okay, I am a student. Thank you. What do you do, Marta Carolina? I am a lawyer too. Ah, you are a lawyer too. Uh, okay, let's go with the next one. How often do you cook? How often do you cook? How often do you cook? Con qué frecuencia cocina? Every day, never, sometimes, usually. Usually. I, I hardly ever. ever. I, I hardly ever. Okay. How often do you listen I to music? I hardly ever cook. Okay. The last question. How often do you listen to music? Always. Sometimes. Always. Usually. Usually. What is your favorite music? Reggaeton? Do you like reggaeton? No. <laughs> <laughs> no, reggaeton, no teacher. Okay, okay. Um, who is your who is your favorite singer, by the way? O Osuna. <laughs> no, no. Okay. No teacher, reggaeton, no. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> Uh, how often do you eat pupusas? Every, every day, every weekend, every, every weekend. Sunday, on Sunday, on Sunday, Saturday or Sunday. Okay. Oh, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Desayuno, almuerzo y cena. Y si hay refrigerio, pupusas también. Yes. <laughs> empacho, empacho. <laughs> ok, ya después de una semana ya no es divertido. To eat pupusas. Ok, nice. Let's see another set of questions. Who wants to read the next question? Let me see. What is it? Here we go. What is it? Ah, this is not a presentation. Okay, can you see? What's your favorite food? What's your favorite food? De toda la comida que existe en El Salvador, what is your favorite? And you say, macarrones are delicious, right? It's spaghetti are delicious. Pupusas are delicious. Uh, do, you still, do you still like pasta? ¿Todavía les gusta la pasta, los macarrones? Yes, I do. Yes, yes. yes. Like pasta. Always, always. <laughs> okay. And what is your favorite food? Can you share with me? What is your favorite food? My favorite food is fish. Fish, okay. And fish is delicious, right? And it has a lot of vitamins. Yeah. So continue eating my, fish. My favorite food is uh, eggs and beans. Eggs and beans, okay. And beans. Eggs are delicious too, right? Yes. Beans, yes. And beans, not so much, right? Uh, anyone? Anyone? Anyone wants to participate? My favorite, my favorite food. food. <laughs> <laughs> um, my, my favorite food is 
uh, Mexican food, pupusas, and beans. Okay, Mexican food, pupusas, and beans. Okay, perfect. Do you like tacos, tortas, enchiladas? Yeah. Guacamole, guacamole too. Okay. Yes, delicious, teacher. Uh, Marta Carolina, what is your favorite food? My favorite food is the uh, meat. Meat, okay. Meat is delicious too, right? Meat, but it is expensive here in the Salvador. Meat is so expensive. How yeah. much is a pound of meat? This one? Six, six, six setting. Okay, ¿cuánto cuesta una libra de carne en El Salvador? In El Salvador, how no. much is a pound? Cuatro, 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 cuatro. I, I, I don't have an idea. Depende de la... Depende de la... De la, de la del tipo de carne. Ah, okay, it depends on the type of meat. Okay. Ah, ya veo que no van al súper, ¿verdad? Al esposo mandan o al esposo. <risa> <risa> Pero asegúrense de los precios que les puedan quitar el vuelto, ¿verdad? <laughs> okay, okay. And what's your favorite drink? What's your favorite drink? My favorite drink is coffee. Okay, coffee, right? Every morning. Coffee, A very yeah. delicious yes. cup of coffee. Every okay. day in the morning. Every day in the morning. Si no toma café, anda dormido todo el día, right? You are asleep the whole day. Yes. Okay. Is, uh, any other? Just coffee. A todos nos gusta el café. We love coffee. Yes. Yes. Yes, teacher. No. Okay. Hasta que la gastritis lo separe. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let's go with the next question. What's your favorite vegetable? What is my, my favorite my favorite vegetable potato. is potato potatoes okay potatoes uh, french fries papa fritas french fries yes. do you like french fries uh, yeah. yes okay uh, uh, okay my yes. favorite vegetable is cucumber cucumber yeah cucumber with salt, with ayahuasca. Okay, delicious, right? Uh, any other? Just cucumber and potatoes. Don't you like tomatoes, carrots, lettuce, cabbage? Repollo solo en, solo en el curtido de las pupusas. Yes. Yes? And the okay. soup, too. So, ah, okay. Una pupusa y media libra de curtido. Delicious. Okay, and what's your favorite fruit? What's your favorite my fruit? Favorite fruit is orange. Okay. My favorite fruit is grape. Thank you. Pineapple. Pineapple. Mango. 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 Mango too. Eh, Maduro o verde? Which one do you prefer? Maduro. Okay. Verde. Okay. <laughs> okay. Now look at this question. What do you need to make a pizza? What do you need to make a pizza? Tomatoes. Yes, tomatoes. Tomatoes. Cheese, flour, pepperoni, pepperoni, sauce, tomato sauce, tomato sauce. Yeah, yeah okay. Seafood. seafood, okay. Shrimp. Shrimp. Yeah. Okay. Okay, excellent. Uh, next, what do you need to cook a chicken soul? Puede levantar la mano a alguien y compartir. What do you need to cook chicken soup? Mm. Okay, who wants to say? First of all, uh, okay, some, some vegetables. Uh, 
some chicken, water, potato, potatoes, carrot, thank you. And what about the water? Do you need some water? Chicken. Yes, okay. Okay, excellent. Yes. Yes, okay. Some noodles. Okay, now look at this question. Look at this question. You are going to share it with your classmate. So who is your favorite singer? I'm going to choose. I'm going to choose here. Let's see. Oscar Baltazar, who is your favorite singer? Uh, my favorite singer is um, um, Danilo Montero. Uh, uh, gospel music. Okay, thank you. Let's look. Mercedes Elena, who is your favorite singer? Mercedes, who is your favorite singer? Okay, Lorena Dinora, who is your favorite singer? What is my favorite, please? Say me, teacher. Who is your favorite singer? Let's see, tengo problemas con el internet, teacher. Ah, okay, I understand. I understand, Mercedes, Elena, no problem. I understand. It is still raining in some part of our country. So... So who is your favorite singer? That is the question. Let's go with the next one. Where do you live? Um, esta pregunta es, ¿dónde vives, right? Where do you live? So I'm going to answer. I live in Cojutepeque, Cuscatlán. So let's go with the next one. Uh, when do you study? ¿En qué momento estudia? When do you study? Clock p.m. Okay. At night. At night. Okay. Let's go with the next one. Which color do you prefer? Red or yellow? What red. is the mask? Which yellow. color do you prefer? Red, red or yellow? What yellow. Yellow. What is your favorite color? My favorite My color is blue. Blue. Like my favorite color is blue. Okay. My favorite color is gray. My favorite color is orange. Orange. Okay. How many rooms does your house have? It has two. 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 It has two rooms. Yes. I live in an apartment. Okay. You live in an apartment and your apartment has two rooms. Yes. Okay, excellent. Thank you, Miriam. Anyone want to participate? Let's go. Six rooms. Six rooms, okay. My house has six rooms. And number seven, how much sugar do you like in your coffee? Zero sugar, teacher. Okay, no sugar <laughs> in my coffee. No, teacher. Okay, ¿cuánta azúcar le gusta en su café? How much sugar do you like in your sugar? One spoon, two spoons. Two spoons. Two spoons. Two spoons. Two spoons. Okay. Small spoon, big spoon, only one. Ah, okay, if the spoon is a small, two. If it is big, yes. just one. Okay. Yes. Okay. Now this is uh, to ask for a reason. Why are you studying English? You can say, because I love it, right? Because I love English. Or because I like English. Because I love English. Okay. Because I want I to... I like English. Okay, excellent. That is a I reason. love it, English. Okay. Bueno, chicos, de todas las preguntas que hemos estado viendo, you are going to share with your classmate. You are going to make a presentation. Okay, take one minute for think what you are going to say. Using these sentences, 
you are going to make a presentation with your classmate. We are going to work in groups. We are going to group and we are going to work in a small groups. And you are going to take one minute. You are going to take one minute to share information about you with your classmate. Information acerca de usted, right? And Teacher, disculpe. Yes. Yes. Este, por si me nombra, voy a ir a cerrar las puertas que se ha venido fuerte el agua. Por si ah. me nombra aquí. Ok, go. Go, Maurice, no problem. Thanks, thanks. Ok. Bueno, entonces tómese un minuto para pensar qué información va a compartir con sus compañeros. You can say hello, good evening, guys. My name is Ever Nieto. I live in Cojutepeque. I, I like sports. I can play soccer. I can play basketball. Um, I like English. I like fish. My favorite food uh, are pupusas. Uh, my favorite fruit is um, apple and so on, right? I live in an apartment. I live in a big house. Um, I never listen to music. I don't like, you can use I don't like. I don't like onions. I don't like carrot. Uh, I don't like Chinese food. So you are going to speak for a minute, one minute. Un minuto para que comparta con sus compañeros. Okay. And at the yeah, end, you say, y al final, says, it has been nice to meet you. Ha sido bueno conocerte, right? It has been a pleasure to meet you. Okay. okay. ¿Ya habían estado antes en algún grupo? Yes. Yes, with some. The first level. In the, in the first level, uh, were you together? Yeah. Estuvieron juntos? Yes. Um, not todos. Ah, algunos. 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 Ah, okay. Uh -huh. Bueno, a Por ver, a ver qué tal el siguiente, ¿verdad? Okay. Are you ready? Are you ready? Están listos? Ya tienen preparado lo que van a decir. Or do you need one minute more? Necesitan un minuto más? Estamos, teacher. Ya regresé. Sorry. Okay, Maurice. Are you ready or do you need a minute? Necesito un minuto más. Bueno, okay. Get prepared. You have to speak for one minute. Right? I'm going to be in the group to check right? that you are speaking. Ok, hoy no preguntas y respuestas. Hoy tiene que decir alguien, ok, yo voy primero. Yo voy a presentarme, yo voy a compartir información, right? Ok, teacher. Ok, here we go. We are 22. My name is Carolina Cerrato. I live in San Salvador. Uh, I live in a small house. Uh, my favorite color is uh, light blue. My favorite fruit is uh, strawberries. My favorite uh, sport is swimming. And, and I'm, I'm glad to meet you. All. Ok, excelente. Así lo vamos a hacer en los pequeños grupos, ¿verdad? Ahorita los voy a dividir, les va a llegar la invitación. Thank you, Marta Carolina. Ok, you can speak about your abilities too. Remember that, using can or can't. So here we okay. go. See you in a minute. Ok, see you in five minutes. We're going to have five minutes to, the, to do this activity. See you in five minutes.
שלא... Ricardo, en Roberto, Michelle, les llegó la invitación. Michelle, Roberto, les llegó la invitación para unirse a los pequeños, a las salas. Hello. Hello, what happened? Teacher, solo creo que estoy yo. Oh, you are alone? Okay, let me send you someone. Ya le mando a alguien, don't worry. Just give me a second. What happened with the rest? Ya le mando a alguien para que comparta. Okay. Hello. Uh, ya, ya compartieron su información. Roxana Marcela y Mercedes Elena. No, teacher, no. es que teníamos problemas por la lluvia y el otro compañero se salió. Uh, ok, so you can start. You can start. Who wants to start? Mercedes or you, Roxana? Y la otra compañera, no sé, no. Se me cortó, lo siento, yo estaba hablando. Ah, um, but you can continue now. No, hello. I live in San Pedro Pro La Pan, Cuscatlán. I like cosas. I like parmelo. I don't like onions. I don't like fish. I love, I, I like, I like dogs and cats. Okay, what, what about your abilities? Um, I, I, can, I can. I can dance. Okay. I can drive. I can, Book. Okay, I now know. now abilities that you don't have using can't. I can't drive. I can think. Okay, and excellent. Now, what do you do in your free time? In my time I watch TV, 
I listen to music and I clean my house. Okay, excellent. Mercedes Elena, it's your turn. Thank you, Roxana. Hi. Hi, yeah. my name is Selena Hernandez. I I can I can play violin. My favorite uh, food is chips, and I live in San Salvador. Um, I like listen to music every day. Um, I play basketball, I need that. Okay, uh, that's it. Uh, you say video games, right? I like to play video games. Is it right? Si dijo eso, I like to play video games? Yes. Yes, okay, what is your favorite? What is your favorite video game? Uh, Mario Kart. No, Minecraft. Minecraft. Okay. Cool. Now, what, what is your favorite food, Elena? It's chicken soup. <laughs> okay, chicken soup. Okay, nice. Uh, thank you. You can continue sharing, right? Pueden continuar um, compartiendo información acerca de ustedes. Thank you. You are doing okay. a great job. You are doing a great job. See you in a minute. Mm. Milo Montero. Hello. Hello. Did you finish? Hola. ¿Ya terminaron? Yes. 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 Ah, yes. Okay. ¿Todos participaron? Everyone participate. Yes. 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 Ah, okay. Un minuto, cada uno. Yes. Ok. Ok. Pueden continuar compartiendo información acerca de ustedes. Your favorite color, your abilities, what do you like to do, what do you do in your free time. So share, share with your classmate. See you in a minute. Después en un minuto. Okay. Hello, hello, welcome back to the class. Hello, hello, I am very sudado. Okay, how was it? How was it? How was your hello. practice? How was your practice? Did you share with your classmate? Ah, good, very good. Okay, I hope it's different. So, Bueno, okay, as you know, today it was our last class. Right? El día de hoy we have our last class. Tuvimos nuestra última clase de este módulo. So, I hope you continue learning English. Uh, please, right, do it, right? You are going to learn a lot in this program. So now you are a um, beginner. You have the diploma of the beginner too, right? I guess you are going to start in beginner three or intermediate. 
Don't you know? Oh, it's three, right? Beginner three. Van a entrar al nivel número tres. So, les deseo éxitos a todos, right? Excellent. Thank you, Thank you. 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 Bueno, uh, do you have something to say? This is the moment. Do you want to share something? Only thank you, teacher. Oh, yes, thank you. <coughs> ok. Bueno, Gracias, la, bueno, por la luz. Gracias por enseñarnos. Ok. Thank you, thank you. Muy okay. productiva la clase. You make a good job. My pleasure. Ok. Thanks, Let thanks. Let me try with my cell phone. Let me try with my cell phone. Aún no viene la luz uh, acá. Okay. So, okay. Uh, stop. It, it stopped raining where you live. La despedida de yes. ciclo. Está lloviendo fuerte. Sigue lloviendo. Está lloviendo fuerte. Está lloviendo. Por acá acaba de terminar. Raining. Ah. Ya pasó también. Okay. Okay. Excellent. Okay, guys, it has been a pleasure to be with you. And what can I say, Ray? Um, this is our last class, and I hope you have learned a lot. Uh, if I have known something, I like that other people uh, learned. And this language is so, it's so good, right? It is going to be useful in your life. Uh, even yes. if you don't apply it, you can teach to other ones, right? Usted puede enseñarle a otros, right? In, mm -hmm. uh, Ok, no hay nada mejor que tener algo que enseñar a los demás. Si usted, yes. si usted puede enseñarle lo que ha aprendido en este curso a alguien más, do it, Ray, do it. Ok. Eh, bueno, si nos vemos por ahí en otro grupo, ¿verdad? Eh, va a ser un placer. Ha sido un gusto haberlos conocido a todos. Eh, es, espero haberlos Igual, ayudado teacher. aunque sea gracias, un poquito teacher. gracias teacher claro que sí aprendí oh. lo bendiga siempre ok bueno me gustaría escuchar la opinión de tres personas y terminamos ¿cómo es tu participé? Hey. Me. thank you Maurice excelente quiero en español se puede Ah, ok, ok, es de las clases. I'm going to allow you to speak in Spanish. Sí, para que me entiendan bien. <risa> <risa> nada, nada más, este, quiero agradecerle a usted, teacher, al grupo de Insafor también por toda la ayuda. Para mí ha sido una gran ayuda. Ya este, los dos módulos, y pues créame que sí he aprendido. He aprendido varias cosas, no todos le queda uno, pero sí he aprendido. Y este. Gracias, solo me queda decirle gracias a todo el Safor, usted por buen trabajo que ha hecho también en este módulo y un gusto haberlo conocido y un gusto a todos los compañeros también bendiciones para todos. Thank you, Maurice. Someone okay. more? Someone more who wants to share? Bueno, nos vamos a desconectar entonces aquí vamos a estar. We're going Se to fueron. Oh. Teacher, teacher, eh, yo, 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 teacher. Eh, yo, bueno, decirle gracias porque creo que todos hemos aprendido un montón de usted. Eh, nos ha explicado súper bien todas, todos los temas de la clase y siempre pues nos ha aconsejado practicar. Así que muchas gracias, teacher. Gracias por, por su tiempo, por su esmero y por <laughs> y, impulsarnos siempre a seguir practicando. Gracias, teacher. Thank you, Miriam. Thank you, Oscar. Oscar has a, a poster there. Teacher, teacher. Teacher, teacher. Teacher, teacher. Okay, thank you, Oscar. Luis? Teacher, solamente como lo decía al principio, dale las gracias a usted, también a Isafor, por todo el esfuerzo que hacen ustedes, especialmente usted como, como teacher nuestro. He aprendido mucho, la verdad que todos los días es un aprendizaje y no me queda más que decirle gracias infinitas y que Dios los bendiga. Teacher. Thank you, Luis. Ok, thank you, Oscar. Un aplauso para todos ustedes. Congratulations. Ok, thank you. You did a great job too. You are a great student, as I said before. You are an excellent student. Me, 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 me.
Thank you, teacher. Dios lo bendiga. Ok, cuídense okay. mucho. Éxitos a todos. Thank you, Oscar. Bye, bye. Bye, bye. bye, bye. Démosle toda la noche por ser la última. <ríe> sí, hasta las 12. <ríe> Vamos hasta las 12. <ríe> <laughs> thanks, okay. Thanks. Bye, bye. bye bye. Bye bye. Take care. Bye teacher. Cuídense mucho. Bye teacher. Bye bye. Bye bye teacher. Good night. Bye bye. Muchas gracias. Good night. Bye good night. Bye bye. Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye bye. Bye. Bye Miriam. Take care. Take care teacher. God bless you. <laughs> Thank you teacher. Bless you. Thank you. Bye bye, Roberto. It has been a pleasure to, to meet you.